everyone welcome back to third episode of accidental love thanks you we were very busy since morning today was a very important day young and me both of us having have to deliver an important order of current traditional dress to a very big client of grandma's after a lot of hard and patience we were able to deliver on the time and receive extra profit too we were very happy and to celebrate our victory we went to have a street food i want to have something spicy thank you what about you young ask excitedly i will have something less spicy young some with some sweet i answered totally excited to a little later after having all fill of the street food we were about to leave when a few goons started bothering us a guy started talking nonsense about me and when he tried to protect they surrounded us unfortunately no one came to help one of them pulled my chair and pushed me on the ground freak stop bothering my brother or i will cut your hands young young punched one of them and shouted at them i was terrified at the moment worrying about my young and myself but then in half half conscious state i realized how someone came near us in his blurry figure gave me back my chair and from the shouts of the gums it was visible that he was beating them out of them life out of them my body gave on to the darkness at that moment and all i remember was that the gentleman helped me who is he jagdish baby i was attending a meeting in my office but my heart was not focusing in it at all i don't know why but i felt extremely restless since morning i will have to call him soon maybe talking to him will help i was so immense in my thought that i almost missed the ringing on my phone um why is namjin here calling me at this time he is usually busy in court at this time of day it must be an important call for sure hi young junior all okay i said feeling a bit worried for my family hello jungkook listen to me very carefully i need you to call our family doctor immediately two boys were being harassed by some Once near on my office and one got injured as well I am big bringing them home there is no one to help and I have to go back to court I cannot take them to the hospital doctors will postpone the treatment saying it 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 is a police case the boy who is injured is particularly a kid maybe a teenager do it fast okay janko khyung Namjoon Hyung explained in a worried tone, "You don't worry, Hyung. I will get the doctor immediately. Jimin Hyung and I will be coming soon. I promised." I will call Thae Hyung soon after this matter is taken care of. I drag Jimin Hyung from the his cabin and explain the critical situation to him. I call the doctor to. John mentioned things we are be I think the bleeding has stopped already it's voice in case in my ear I'm very thankful to all of you for all that you did for us we are strangers for each other and he still you did so much for my brother Tham and me Hyung's voice brought me back to consciousness everything was blurry for a moment but then slowly I could see some people surrounding me Hyung was hovering at my left. I was lying on the king size bed of a huge bedroom. Hyung, are you all right? Hyung asked me nervously. Yeah, I feel better. Ah, I felt a sting pain on my forehead. Don't touch it, son. The wound is still fresh. We just did the immediate first aid. Aid. 
my grandson will be coming and any minute now and the doctor she said a graceful lady explain to me how come we and we are here here what about those goons i asked awkwardly let me explain hi i am kim namjoon i am a lawyer i was leaving my office for some work when i found you brothers struggling with those goons and then i saw how they were misbehaving with you and i started don't worry i took care of them they wouldn't travel anyone now for the rest of their lives you both needed help so i brought you here for to my house as i still have work and i don't want to make it a police case without your concern namjoon he explained to me so uh, Oh so he was the kind man who helped me he saved us thank god you sent this man as a helping hand for us i cannot thank you enough you saved us today anything could have happened if you had not replay reached there in time i will forever be in debt to you thank you a lot jungkook namjoon hyung i said and folded my hands cuz I cannot bow like lying like this. Hey, it's okay. No need to thanks. So you boys in trouble and did what any other person would do. Believe me when I say you lying there all alone in blood. I feel like I will kill them. I don't have any brother. And I felt a sudden urge. sudden urge to protect you so that's what i did now forget all about this and let me introduce you to our family while the doctor arrives okay namjoon hyung said with a hand on my head i smiled nodded as each member was introduced i felt a bond towards them these people deserve all the happiness in their world bless them god jungkook explained we are along with Jimin Hyung and our family doctor walk inside our house i made informers that everyone was in my room i felt a weird change in the bridge as if it was trying to inform me about something but i dismissed it on entering my room with doctor i got out of my life oh my my love my thing he was lying on the bed with the bandage on his head his brother yongi and my family surrounding him and making him laugh then i shouted in fear everyone look at me in silence and then look at, at me with wide eyes and an open oshed mouth jungkook king what are you doing here then i asked what the heck then you got injured oh god It was you and your brother who were hurt by those good for nothing weak creatures. I rushed towards Theung in panic and held his hand in mine. I wish I could hug him at the moment, but circumstances were not in my favor right now. Okay, you know Theung. Have you two met before? Chin Young asked me silly. I have to come up with an excuse. what about i say now but suddenly thing took in the matter in his own hands i am fine jungkook hyung namjoon hyung saved hyung and me at the right time and jin hyung and i was not aware that you all are jungkook hyung's family i actually met him a few times in jeon design so we know each other oh thank god i will forever be thankful for you nam jun hyo you saved my life my thank you what the this boy saved my problems so easily he made up an excuse which was somewhat true in a sense he is my angel the doctor is here let him do your check up there we will wait outside young hyo why don't you stay here with him huh? 
I said. All of us were waiting outside Jimin Hyung was eyeing the door as if Yoongi would jump out any time I snored dead in my mind but then I walked towards Nam Jin Hyung. I needed to sort this out. Hyung who were those grooms? I will find them and give them the most service punishment on the earth. I said harshly, fisting my palm in anger, relax, Jungkook. The police took care of them. You don't worry. I am a lawyer. I will make those creeps suffer in prison for the rest of their lives. I know how to handle such matters. You stay away from all of this stuff. If I needed your help, I will ask you for it right now. You concentrate on them. You know him, right? I think we should inform his family and then when he feels better, you and Jimin could drop them home. Let him rest for a, for now, okay? Nam Jin Hyung assured me. God being in love is so not easy. I feel so ignited at the moment i cannot express my feelings towards them huh? nor i can openly tell my family about him but one thing is for sure i will have to increase my face thing needs to know how i feel about him he needs to know about his importance in my life and suddenly without the thought i went down in front of the god making sure no one saw me. I gathered some courage. I closed my eyes in concentration and tried to thank. Thanks God. Yeah, thanks God because I didn't believe in him until now. Thank you for saving my love. I never believe in you but thank believes in you and I will respect his faith. So thank you for sending Nam Jin Hyung at the right time to help him. And then I turned to go back, a maid who was standing near the kitchen gave me a fearful look. She seems horrified to see me in front of God. I rushed back upstairs feeling awkward. Oof. Thanks, POV. Currently I am resting in Jungkook Hyung's room. As Nam Jung Hyung said, it was Jungkook Hyung's room and the best part about being here it's that the his entire family is so lovely and fun to be around initially when i was awake i felt a bit uneasy about being in a strange place surrounded by unknown people but gradually all of them made me super comfortable jen hyung nam jun hyung grandma and uncle become such a great friends and i did not want to leave their house at all However, I did not want to overstay my welcome. Henceforth, Young and I decided that we will tell the Jian family about us leaving in pretty soon. It was not right to take advantage of their hospitality. On the contrary, when I mentioned the fact that to my family, all of them turned with a glossy gloomy maze why it is necessary to leave thank dear uncle exclaimed yes you are you want needs to be healed it is not good to live in such condition grandma advised and we are here having so much fun listening about it. yes your wand is not needs to be still healed it is not good to live in such condition, Grandma advised, and we are having so much fun listening about your Daigui stories, Jin Hyung pleaded, but I was, but it was Jungkook Hyung whose words made me stop. Don't even think about leaving Kim Thang, you are not alright. The doctor said completely rest for two days and I know what is going on in your mind. 
no one here thinks that you are being a problem for us so give up on those ridiculous thoughts and as far as your family is concerned Hyungi Hyung and grandma have informed them about your situation grandma has assured your grandma that we will take care of you till you completely recover now drink your tea saying that he continued reading the file again suddenly the entire family kept glancing to the two of us for a minute and then i could see jinhyun and grandma smirk at one another i blushed looking at their teasing expression i had to speak about this to jungkook hyung his family is supposed to get hyung and jimin hyung together jungkook hyung's word for me might have given them wrong indication heartbeat god what is the name of this unknown feeling why and why did i feel a sense of joy hearing such words of care from jungkook hyung Jungkook's pure sense of pride washed over me watching my thing lying in my room on my bed he looked at each while talking to my family it thrilled me to infinity this is his future family after all even though seeing him all bended up killed me to no extent still i smile in content in the knowledge of him safe secure and close to me on the other hand jimin hyung was going all gaga over his young jimin hyung tried to find different ways to talk to young at one time i stopped spotted him in the kitchen helping young in making turmeric milk for him <sighs> Time passed quickly and soon it was night time. Everyone retired to their rooms. Jin Hyung suggested me to shift to the guest room and I wholeheartedly agreed. Hyungi will be sleeping with Taehyung to take care of him. When I went to my room to get my stuff, Taehyung was not in bed. Silly, here. Where is he? Washroom? No, the lights were switched off. I ran to the pool side with the door in the other side of my room, only to sigh and relief when I saw Thayam standing and washing the water knee keenly. Thayam was, what are you doing here? And why are you standing? Take this, silly hate. Are you listening to me, Thayam? I am talking to you. I was about to grab his shoulder when Thayam turned around. Jungkook Hyung, everything got messed up again. What will you be do now? Thayong asked quickly. What is wrong, Nadia? This time I did not lose my cool. I knew this boy will will now. Jungkook Hyung, I think we unknowingly each other from unknowing each other from before made. Jin Hyung and Grandma suspicious about us. We plan to unit Yoong Gi Hyung and Jimin Hyung, right? But both Jin Hyung and Grandma think that we are interested in each in one another. Thayong particularly shouted in my ear. Oh, really, Thayong? Is that so? How can you say that? I smirked at him because I saw them staring at us, and then I smiled secretly at each other. Now your family will also assume we are engaged. That is the only thing left to edit on the peel of our problem. Their concern is the matter is useless, they said. His two eyes like eyes getting wide and ev- with every word. I started walking towards Thayong and slowly minimized to the distance between us he got nervous and moved back with each step of mine we played the game for a while till things back touched the wall i trapped him with my both arms and his expression turned to my favorite one that oh said ma teasing me to no end what are you doing
what if someone come and assume something wrong as it is we are in big problem are you listening to me jungkook young what are you doing thank again try to turn to my tomato like them why do you get so flustered if someone mention or indicate about us being together we are just friends right then why does the thought of getting engaged to me make you all red can't hang your eyes are shut your breathing is swelled and if i am not wrong then your heartbeat are escalated right now why is that they hung i asked them i took a step back from him when they hung realized this he opened his eyes looked at me all i looked down towards my gift that dot they hung raised i crushed his bracelet and left the pool side but my crazy boy had other plans he always need to have the last word yeah so what is the problem and i don't get flusher mr jian this is just acidity a little bit of heartbeat and breathlessness happen in it don't you watch tv commercials all i need is some medicine and things will be fine it is very quick too in seconds acidity gone don't think that i get bothered by hearing the talk of our engagement i am already commit committed to bts don't get any ideas have you even seen have you even seen young books their six pack abs or his lean muscles have you ever heard augusta is rap huh i turn around getting all angry and thehung just blurred hair over his fingers with holds hands on his waist god this bts what is all the hype about him six packs leanness uh, how can he even think about any other guys like that I was about to give him a youthful word when Yoongi walked inside my room freak it. Wrong timing brother-in-law, actually dual brother-in-law. I quickly grabbed my pillow and leaned. I quickly grabbed my pillow and leaned and left the room to sleep in the guest room. Thanks POV, even though I managed to come up with an lame excuse of acidity, his words rang in my ear because whatever Jungkook Kim said was truth. I do get flustered in his proximity. I feel weird when anyone talks about us being together. I turn all red when Jungkook Kim mentioned anything about the engagement and today when he trapped me between the wall and his bored arms. I went numb. Have I started for having feelings for Mr. Jang Jang? Oh God! Tenga, come on, let's sleep. Jin Hyung has given me this nightdress for you to wear. You go change them, and then I will get freshen up. Okay? I nodded with blank. expression and walk towards the bathroom next morning at the breakfast table everyone was having food but my mind kept going back to jungkook young he did not join us today i wanted to ask jin hyung but i stopped thinking that jin hyung might again take things in wrong way once we were done grandma suggested me to go back to my room and rest and recover i woke up still sulk- sulking I wanted to talk to Jungkook Hyung. Is he angry with me? But why am I feeling so restless? God, this feeling is going to kill me one day. And I know why you are enjoying this a lot. No, no, I will get rid of this feeling. Perhaps I will go to the guest room and apologize. Simple. However, before that, I quickly got. the gift i had planned to give jungkook kyung wala it was still 
lying in my bag a few minutes later i took a u turn and rushed inside the guest room in an urgency i totally forgot to look up and dash in a speed only to bump onto jungle king and lose my balance but jungle king managed to stop my fall and sank in my in his arm around my waist to keep me steady both of us look at each other and for once i could not take away my eyes from him time he stopped and still but then i remember what to do what i had to do jungle king listen i'm sorry for making you angry yesterday i just wanted to give you an answer for making me red with all words why did you not come for breakfast i'm your friend right and then why are you upset with me your friend jungle king please say something i felt so awful right now thank i am not upset with you believe me it was just a talk yes i felt a little bit anger but not with you never thank you are very special for me them how can i be upset with you ha huh? one of jungkook's arm left my wrist and i rested on my cheek i realized i had tears in my eyes he wiped them for me i was then it was then that i came back to the real world and took in what position we are we were in i looked at jungkook with wide eyes and he mirrored my looks as well god heart beat again does this mean i am falling in with jungkook you thanks for your wish jungkook you let me go when i he realized how awkward i was feeling all of a sudden but when he put a distance between us my heart ached for his touch and comfort thank are you all right he asked me yeah yeah i'm fine I said softly believe me thank I am not upset with you I got up late today hence did not came for breakfast I was in rush to get ready for office this is it I wouldn't miss breakfast ever again around you okay he tried to assure me yeah I almost whispered what is wrong with you Kim thank your voice is barely audible This is against your high tone rules. Oh, this man make me melt like butter with his words about about don't think about that focus. Remember you can came to give him his gift. Oh yes, his gift. Ah, uh, Jungle King, I have something for you. I informed him for me. He asked in a surprised tone, "Yeah, actually I wanted you to have this." My voice trailed as I opened my Yeah, actually I wanted you to have this. My voice trailed as I opened my fist, my palm, palm held my special locket. It had so many memories attached to it. What is this thing? Jungkook Young question me this is my grandma's locket Jungkook Young there is something about me that i have not told you my Jungkook Young is my cousin and my Emma is actually my auntie Emma and grandma adopted me when my biological parents passed away in a car accident i was only 8 year old this was a special to me my parents named was from letter j and hence the j letter locket this is not made of gold or diamond and just mere silver but i have kept it safe for very long jungle hyung you gifted me those bracelet and today i want to give this to you my was become very breaking with every word thing i i don't know what to say but how can i keep this thing this is your parents it's it is a significant part of your memories and you 
आर गिफ्ट इन दिस टू मी वाई आई जिस फील आई डोंट डिजर्व दिस एंड दिस इज प्राइसलेस पोजिशन डियर इट इज वर्थ मोर देन एनी डायमंड इन दिस वर्ल्ड आई एम नॉट डिस रिस्पेक्टिंग योर गेस्ट आई फील ऑनर्ड बट यू आर श्योर जंक आस्क मी अगेन आई नॉट एट लुकिंग एट हेम ऑनेस्टी आईज अलर थिंग दिस इज वेरी स्पेशल गिफ्ट एंड आई विल ऑलवेज कीप इट सेफ प्रोमिस बट आई वॉन्ट यू टू पुट इट ऑन मे विल यू जंक आस्क विद मच अफेक्शन दैट आई सिंपली हेल डेट अप एंड आई डेट अराउंड हिज नेट बींग सो क्लोज टू हेम वॉज हैविंग स्ट्रेंज इफेक्ट ऑन मे थैंक यू एंड आई एम रियली सॉरी टू हेयर अबाउट योर पेरेंट्स ही सेड इन अ सैड टोन आई जस्ट गिव हेम अ हाफ स्मेल एंड वॉक आउट ऑफ द रूम जंक थेम हैज नो आइडिया वाट ही डिड राइट ना ही पर्टिकुलरली क्लेम्ड मे एज हिज ओन ब्रेंडिंग मे विद हिज फैमिली position and here i was trying to gain his affection he has feelings for me that is kishto clear i touched the locket and closed my eyes grandma gave your future son in law your blessings i will always keep them safe and happy i will give i give my words i left the office but the entire day my mind keep going back the memory moment i spent with him this morning the way he lost his balance the way he rushed towards me in panic and i was somehow upset with him i wanted he wanted me to be around him and he gifted me the most expensive thing in the world he gave me his love unknowingly today sir that is all for now do you have any suggestions or should we go ahead with the proposal hobi hung's voice rang in my ear no i cannot go ahead not yet i have not even uttered i love you to the hung it is too soon for proposal right now i need time to convince him i said in a reflex without realizing that i was in the middle of an important board meeting and suddenly i heard simin hyung and hobi laughing loudly like crazy that brought me back and i felt horrible looking at my looking at my staff right now uh, excuse me everyone i i just and i ran away quickly leaving a laughing simin hyung and hobi on the floor crap what the heck Kim Tae Hoon gone. Are gonna are my days of being the cold. Jiang Jungkook ko thanks POV. I was supposed to make plans for getting Hyun and Jimin Hyun together and look what am I doing? Rolling over Jungkook Hyun's words and memories. As soon as Jungkook Hyun came back from his office today, I will discuss about getting their love story on track. Yeah, that is perfect. A few hours later, it was evening. I was resting in my in Jungkook Hyun's room while Jungkook Hyun was begging me about leaving tomorrow for Grandma's house. They only listen. We will stay here only till tomorrow morning. Then we will go back to Grandma's house. We should not stay here for too long. It is not good. And till how long we will occupy Jungkook's room? Huh? As it is day after tomorrow is it is faced well. We need to do a lot of preparation. Right, Youngi. Young explained a festival that is it. Got, got it. This is the perfect opportunity. Opportunity. I will ask Jungkook Young and Jimin Young to come to the big church where we go for the festival prayers, and then Jimin Young will get the chance to spend time with Youngi Young. Some awesome. Wow, Thay Young, you are the best. Huh? Of course, young. We are absolutely right. You are absolutely right. Festival is around the corner, so much preparation to be done. We will leave tomorrow morning after breakfast. Okay, I ask. 
एज एक्सपेक्टेड योंग यूंग नॉरेड एंड बैन डांस टू गेट मी सम मिल्क सोन इट वॉज डिनर टाइम जंग कुक हिंग वॉज बैक फ्राम हेज ऑफिस वी आर आल हैविंग अवर डिनर एंड आई सा हेम गेस्टरिंग मी टू गेस्टरिंग टू द टेबल एंड देन हेम सेल्फ नो ही वॉज टाइम टू से दैट सी आई एम हेयर इटिंग विद यू हैप्पी अनदर हैप्पी नाव इट वॉज टाइम टू सेट माई प्लान्स इन मोशन आई हेट यूंग यूंग स्पोर्ट लाइटली ट्राइंग टू रिमाइंड हिम अबाउट टेलिंग एवरी वन अबाउट अस लिविंग ही गॉट इट एंड स्टार्ट स्पीकिंग ग्रैंड मैम वी विल लीव लाइक टू लीव टमारो मॉर्निंग एज इट इज़ फेस्टिवल एंड अराउंड द कॉर्नर एंड वी नीड टू हेल्प ग्रैंड मा इन प्रिपरेशन आई होप यू डोंट माइंड वी लव स्टेंग हेयर एंड यू आल बट Now we have to make a move pretty soon. Young Hee Hyung said, "Okay, my dear, I have I wish you could stay for longer, but you boys are very nice and kind. Fine, you may go tomorrow." Now, okay. Grandma replied, but out of the corner of my eyes, I saw Young Hee Hyung glaring at me. Oh, um, maybe he did not understand that I why I am doing this. I will talk to him before sleeping and discuss my plan. Bless us, God. Jungkook's POV. What the? How can Taehyung leave so soon? Did he not even inform me? Taehyung, you are not allowed to take an decision like this without discussing anything with me. How could you? I need to have a word with. This crazy soul once everyone retired to their room post dinner i quickly walked to my room and stood at the pool side waiting for my dear thangi his push step is adoring i could easily recognize them when he came closer to the sliding door of the pool side i pulled his wrist and dragged him to the pool side he panicked for a second but sighed in relief realizing it was me Oh, Jungko, can you scared me? What happened? Why did you suddenly pull me like that? He asked in a slight anger. Really, Tia, you don't know why I did it. Tell me, Tia, when were you planning to inform me about your departure tomorrow morning? What is the need to leave so urgently? You still need rest, and I wouldn't allow. Jungko, can you interrupted me in the main sentence? Tia interrupted me in the main sentence. Jungkook young doctor said clearly that two days are enough for rest and as far as living without information you are you is concerned i was about to come to meet you in your room how can we forget about young and jimin young we need to work on as a team remember so i came up with this idea that on the day of festival you can come without your brother with your brother to the big church in seoul we and hyun will be there for prayers and in way jimin hyun can spend time with yoongi hyun see my idea is great right then said lifting his ego fine you are allowed to leave but don't take too much stress and i promise that All four of us will meet on festival day and another thing I want an answer thing you take time till festival but I want an honest answer of my question I said hastily what question Jungkook here he started stuttering as usual the reason why you gifted me your most important position Is only friendship, or are we more than friends? Ask him and kissed him on his forehead. He gasped and gaped at me with an open mouth. I will wait for your answer. Can thank see you on festival. Good night. And with that, I casually walk out of the room to be continued. Everyone, how was it? I know I did a lot of mistake in today's episode and voice over because I forgot to do voice over and I was about to forget to update it today. 
so yeah ignore it and enjoy it and whatever you feel about the episode tell me in the comment section see you again with another one shot day after tomorrow till then take care say bye bye bye